click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon for watching more update videos thank you assalamu alaikum friends this is sami and you are watching civil engineers youtube channel dear friends in this video lecture today i'm gonna show you here that why civil engineers use steel and concrete for construction work so this is the important topic for today and if you need the article about this video so the link is in the description of this video click on that link and also enjoy reading article about this video or just visit to my website www.civilglobal.com let's get start and don't forget to like this video and share this video with your friends okay so concrete plus steel is equal concrete plus steel is equal your structure will be safe safe right another point steel so we know that steel is too much strong but it's also too much expensive so we can't support only steel and construction work so steel is equal expensive Another point, concrete. So we can't use only concrete in construction work. That's why, because concrete is strong in compression, but it's weak in tension, okay? So don't use only concrete in construction work, okay? And construction works okay so this is the other point so here are some notes that why we use steel and concrete for construction works so we know that we know that concrete is strong and compression but it's weak and tension Concrete is strong and compression. But it's weak and tension. Therefore, we have to use steel with concrete to save the structure member okay because concrete is weak in tension okay so other point we also know that steel is strong in tension but it's weak and compression so therefore we have to use steel and concrete to save the structure member because concrete is weak and tension and steel is strong and tension so therefore with concrete and steel combination we can save the structure as it is another point that why the concrete is strong and compression okay because we take the large area of concrete so therefore concrete is strong in compression and other point we have a steel is weak and compression because we use the small cross-sectional area and structure so therefore it comes buckling okay so suppose this is the column this is the column and we use here steels okay so we know that steel is weak and compression because here is a small 
area of steel okay so this is the die of steel okay so this is the small cross sectional area so therefore if the load comes on the steel so the area is too much small so it's not able to support so therefore it becomes buckling so this is the important and if you need the article so you must click on the uh, our website a link which is in the description and for more for more like these kind of videos about civil engineering you must subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon to get notification about any video thanks for watching bye bye